on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Uh, you lazy girl. Come on, let's go home. But I... No buts. Come on. Fine, wait. You... You smell that? You're just trying to distract me so you can stay up later. No, just I'm serious. <sighs> Fine. <clears throat> what? You do smell it now, don't you? Yes, that's... That's blood, isn't it? Yeah, but... Something's different about... Wait, that's your blood. Uh, what are you talking about, Uncle? No, I am serious. That's... Wait, it's not just yours. It smells... Like... A collection. But it's coming th from that building. Well, she'll be checking... No! You are... A citizen, pedestrian, someone who should even be here. I'm the hero, so I need to check it out. But, Uncle! No means no. No, no. okay. I'm fine with you leaving me out of it. Really? Yeah, I'm fine with that. But don't just go into a situation alone when we smell blood in there. <clears throat> oh, you're right. Uh, I guess I'll call for backup. You stay here and don't do anything stupid. Uh, how dare you? I know you. <sighs> That's fair. As soon as Hondal just leaves, he is fighting the urge to go in and just stop whatever's happening, especially since it's his blood in there too. So, yeah, that doctor seems to be a, a little bit uh, suspicious now. He, who knows, he might not even be a doctor. As soon as uh, Houndog does show back up, he knows that Suzuku is gone. Oh no, 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 you gotta be kidding. <sighs> what took you so long? <clears throat> Wait, you were hiding? Of course I was. You know, someone came out, so I had no choice. What? As Hondo just sheds a tear, he's like, what's wrong? Why are you crying? He's like, you actually listened to instructions and followed them. Uh, oh, that's fucked up. Language. Still. Seriously, I can follow instructions. Uh huh. All right, you lay. This is a uh, the clutch of heroes we have. Hmm? Oh, they seem like a uh, pretty pretty uh low class ones. Trust me, they have good quirks. Are you sure, kid? Trust us. Hell, I'm from Endeavor's agency. Really? Huh. What's your name? <sighs> you, you don't have to worry about it. You're, you're probably too young to remember it. Her name is Burning. Oh. 
Cool. And what about you two? We're the War Hose Heroes. Nice. Actually, yeah, I do. I do remember some of you guys. All right, all right. Cool. This could sound pretty, pretty damn uh, nice. But as soon as he burst through the doors, they see puddles of blood. Everyone just retching except for Izuku and Hound Dogs are. Whoa, that's a. This is gonna leave a big stain. As soon as the daughter just like, the fuck are you doing? Him seeing a glimpse of Izuku is like, you! Me? What the hell are you? Huh? I've tested your blood with several other strains of animals, people, but something something special about yours. In fact, you seem to have a very unique genetic pattern similar to several others that I've seen in previous studies. What's he talking about, Uncle? Uncle? So, you're a hound dog. You're his uncle? Yes. Well, perhaps I need a blood sample from you as well. <laughs> well, as you can see, you are clearly surrounded. Well, yeah, it just doesn't seem like that. But <clears throat> doesn't mean I'm alone. As muscular, start stomping his big ass feet, and then Gigantomachia, smaller but still him. It's pretty much who am I here to kill? Take your pick. I don't give a damn. But I need Hound Dog and that boy alive. Do whatever you want with the rest. As the fight is relatively easier. All things considered, because Lushmere, he does have both eyes, but he risks getting actually killed here. Especially with Hound Dog uh, getting more feral. What do I mean by this? His adrenaline is starting to pump through his veins. He's starting to get angry. He's snarling. He's turning into a legit beast. And it only gets more dangerous for Muscular once he he pretty much pimp slaps the water hose heroes into a concrete wall. It's them seemingly dead. This being the straw that broke the camel's back. As yes, poor poor Muscular gets his head torn off brutally. Everyone shocked at the pure savagery. While us, we're pretty much like, fuck yeah, fuck that bastard. Gigantomaki is the only one who actually, yeah, withstand Hound Dog's attacks. Actually, being him, it seems. Everyone else is pretty much. I would call burning. She can't do anything really. He's wondering, wait, what is this guy's quirk? What can he do? Then he just, uh, Uncle, what if I go get help? It'll take too long. The only way you can. No. No, don't you do it. Like, but oh, come on, it might be the only way. No. 
I forbid you, your father forbid you from doing it. But if I don't, you could die. Then I will have served my purpose as a hero. Oh, to hell with that. But before Izuku could even utter a peep, this is when Gran Torino and All Might show up. Both of them snarling mad and, yeah, seeing the scene, muscular severed head, hound dog beat down, burning pretty much unconscious, as well as the Water Hose heroes. They are freaking out and uh, looking for Gran Torino. It is an enclosed space, so he has a lot of options for attack. Downside is... Jacanto Makia's, you know, additional quirks are making it very hard to do any actual damage. So this is when Izuku's like, okay, I have no choice here. I'm going to have to step in. He tries, but All Might keeps getting in his way. What I mean by that, he keeps pushing Izuku back, telling him to stay out of this. This is no place for a child. Nobody pissing off a young Izuku. He's like, I'm not that much. How old are you? Uh, well, I. Exactly. Yeah, my uncle's hurt, and he can't last much longer, so let me do something, or else I will tear through you first. Are you really threatening a hero? You're not a hero. Uh, what? You are not a hero. You are too young to be a hero. What, what are you in high school? <laughs> He's right, Toshi. Master, I. He's right. <laughs> you're what, kid? You're, you're all right. Hmm. Wait, I was right? Yeah, he's a UA student. You're from UA? Yes. Them pretty much ignoring the fact that the doctor escaped, as well as Gigantomachia. As soon as he just comes to her senses, it's like, Okay, let, let's let us uh, address that some some blame is uh, meant to be shared. Well, mostly yours for be, for not catching the crazy doctor. Mine for distracting you. Damn it. Boy. What? Uncle, you're alive! <sighs> no thanks to you. Hey, I was going I was going to roar and everything, but I uh, Let's just get this guy. Please. Uh, uh. Uh, how? Huh? Oh, hey, kid. How, dog? How are you? What? Am I still walking? I heal fast. You took more repeating than anyone else. Yeah, so? How are you not dead? I'm tougher. 
my quirk allows me to heal a lot faster than you peoples. What was that, Izuku? Nothing. Quirk. Yeah, whatever you say. Is there something you need to say, boy? Uh, nothing. Nothing at all. As then a loud explosion is heard. And they're just wondering, wait, is there another villain attack? It's like, you know what? Uh, listen, uh, kid, call me All Might. Right. All Might. You and Gran Torino take these heroes to recover your girl. Get them healed. I don't want to risk anyone. You know. I am going to deal with whoever's making all that racket. But I... Rule number one, kid, listen to your superiors. I'm going to be no more hero. Good luck with that. G good luck with that. I I believe wholeheartedly that you can become the no one, number one hero. As Izuku, he just wanders off as they are arguing just to see what's going on. In which... Yeah, the doctor, Jayana Makia, they're still uh, causing a bit of a stir with this mystery. <laughs> this dude is like, wait, who's that they're following? Huh. Well, he sells my blood. Izuku running off and tackling the doctor. He's like, give me my blood back. Him smiling as he tosses it right into the air and off one catches it. And judging himself with it. And seemingly healing from whatever injuries he had previously. Which begs the question, what the hell? Did you just do? My master needed a little pick me up. And once I learned about your blood, I just thought this could really come in handy. And it is. It's not pretty. Buildings destroyed. People being evacuated. Ambulances. Being called out. Fire. Fires. Policemen. A shit ton of heroes. As soon as Howard Dog arrives, he sees Zuku covered in blood. As he's just crying. Uh. Izuku, what's wrong? I, I didn't, I didn't have a choice. What? As he sees this woman in Izuku's arms, is she, is she dead? <laughs> We'll find out soon enough. What's that supposed to mean? Him getting a closer look at her arm. Seeing that... Yeah, there are bite marks. You didn't. I... I didn't have a choice. She would have died otherwise. You could have killed her now. She, uh, you don't even 
way I was going to work. But I had to try. Let's go. What about her? No, yeah, we are taking her with us just in case. Uncle. Enough. We're going home. <laughs>